first sight, uh, the sociology of death and dying is not a very likely topic because in sociology we study uh, social relations, relations between collectives and individuals, etc. And uh, dying or death is the moment where these relations end. Um, but what we'll do this semester is to give this a second and third examination. Uh, and we're going to talk about how uh, death and dying is actually an extremely sociological topic. Uh, we're going to talk about uh, four main topics. Uh, the first topic would be uh, how uh, social circumstances, such as poverty or social isolation, uh, increase or decrease the likelihood that a person would die. Uh, so basically this would be a conversation about the social determinants of death. The second thing that we will do is to talk about uh, the cultural attitudes toward death, uh, mainly in the West, but not only, and how cultural attitudes toward death have changed historically. Third, we're going to talk about definitions of death. How do medical communities uh, define death, whether they define it by the cessation of heartbeat or the cessation of breathing, or whether they define it by a new criteria, such as brain death. How does law define death? And how do these definitions change historically and socially? The fourth thing that we will do is to talk about dying and how the social category of the person who dies has become something that professionals, politicians, uh, sometimes economists even, think about, write about, and manage, uh, and how all of these people construct the dying process in modern societies.